Here with Endicott men's and women's cross country head coach Spencer Lang, freshman runner Maeve Kelly on our left, and James Dwyer on our right catching up with the cross country team. Coach, we'll start with you first. Impressive showing for both teams last weekend at the Bowdoin Invitational. The men finished fourth out of 10, and the women finished third out of 10 against some really strong programs. Just talk about both teams and how they did. Yeah, I was really happy with how they performed on both sides. On the guys' side, there were eight PRs out of 12 guys running. Really couldn't ask for much more than that. They really fought hard in a fast race. On the women's side, very impressed again. A lot of freshman runners on the team, freshmen, sophomores. And this was their first 6K, and they handled it very well, especially with a little slow start. Uh, they responded perfectly, I think, to uh, the change in pace as the race developed. Maeve, we'll ask you first. Obviously, your first 6K of the year and your first year running cross country. Just kind of take us through the race and, and how it went for you. So I tried to sing with some of the older girls um, in the top seven so that I, they could teach me how to pace myself. And at first, it went out a little fast for myself, my first mile, and then towards the middle, I settled in, and then towards the end, I tried picking it up again. It was a, it was a little long, but I enjoyed it. <laughs> James, just talk about your race, second on the team as far as individual finish. Just talk about your race. Um, I had a really, really good race, actually. Um, I PR'd, it was very flat, uh, very easy to to feel the pace you were going at the whole way around. It was a five lap course for us there about uh, as an 8K. Um, what I really liked was before the race, Coach had given us sort of a rundown of how he looks at the 8K and when he's running it. And uh, I really, really appreciated that and, and felt it in my race, you know, go out in the first mile, um, but but get your place by the second mile and then fight for it uh, third and fourth because that's where it's going to be tough and then really kick it for that last mile. Um, and, and I felt that I accomplished that pretty well and uh, it was a very, very good race. Um, we ended up coming out on fourth for the guys and, and a beautiful, beautiful day up in boat. Coach, just transitioning to next week, just talk about the training this week and then going into the James Early Invitational in the week. Yeah, similar to uh, the past two weeks, we have really good opportunity this first week to get in some solid workouts, get a little extra recovery before the next race. James Early at Westfield is a huge race. It's, uh, it's a good regional preview. There's going to be a lot of regional teams there. It's a big race. Last year, there were over 400 runners on both sides. So uh, it's going to be great exposure again for the young runners to learn how to run in packs and just you know, look to the next person and keep raising. All right, thank you and good luck in a few weeks. Thanks.